hello everyone welcome to our video tutorial about creating forms in this tutorial we are going to learn how we can create forms from the blank form option and the form design option to follow this tutorial we are going to work with our database for workers wage so we shall click to open it so to create a form from the blank form option we shall go to create tab then from the create tab we have this option for blank form so when we click on it this is how your blank form will be opened when you create your form using this option the form is also opened in the layout view as we can see so if you don't have the same features like on my screen let's assume this uh, feature is also not there then what you do you just go straight to this option we are seeing the add existing fields so we shall click on it that is if you have not been having it so when you click on it this field list uh, pen is displayed for you now from this uh, field list pen this is where we are going now to get our fields from so from this list we can see november and this is the table for instance the it has it has the it is showing for us that the fields available in other tables so it shows you if we had like 10 tables then all those tables would be displayed here but since in our database we have only one table which is november that's why we see this table november displayed here now we have to use this table to create our form because we have a blank screen now to do that we shall click on this plus symbol so when we click on that plus symbol then the fields available in this table known as november is displayed for us so if you want to hide these fields then you again click on this minus symbol and then you will not see those fields so let's display the fields so when we display our fields we now need to add these fields in this area we see here so to do that we shall go to this first field we double click on it so when we double click the field will be displayed here so what we are doing right now is that we are adding fields to this space so that we can create our form then we go to the next which is first name then our last name district date of birth wage total already paid cleared pay as you earn so that is how we can add the fields to this blank screen now that we are through with adding the fields in this blank space we can even now view the records so this means that we have created a form using the blank form option you can even view the rest of the records using this navigation uh, button so that's how we can use this blank uh, form option to create the form we have a lot of things we can do with this form we can try to edit as we can see those options here you can click to select the entire form if you want if you want to enlarge these field sizes then you can do that by doing that if it is not looking nice then you can click and then you reduce on these ones so if you want these fields to have borders all over then you click and then you say i want grids on both sides so when we click aside then we can see that now we have our form having the borders if you want to increase the size of the content within the the form then we shall select the entire 
form then we can increase on the font size we can change also the the font style we can still give it any font style that you want if you want to work with the font color you can still do that and so on so that's how we can create a form using this blank form option and with this form still you can view it in any way you want for example the form view you can also open this form in the design view so that's how you can work with this form if you want to go ahead and save this form then just like we saw in the previous tutorials then what we are going to do is to right click and click on save so let's call it blank blank form for workers after then we click on ok so when we click on ok then we have the name of our form on the form tab area and to close this form you just use this option for close so when you close your form will be displayed from this list as blank form for workers in our next example we are now going to see how we can create a form using the form design so to do that we shall click on create then we click on form design so when you click on form design this is how the form design is displayed for you so just like with the blank form you can also add now the fields to this area so to do that you simply double click on this field names if this field list pen is not there just like that then you come and click to display it so we start by double clicking so when we double click the field will appear there so we do the same for the remaining fields so with this uh, style of creating forms you can decide even to neglect some fields that you may not want to be in the form so we have added all our fields to the form now we can also do anything that we want with this form as per now we can now enlarge on the size of the fields to that size we desire so to do that we select this first option then we can enlarge this then to do it uh, for the rest of these other fields we are going to select click hold then move to select the all of them so after doing that you right click when you right click you go to size so when we reach size we shall click this option to widest so we click widest so that they match this first option then we can also widen these other uh, fields so we shall first of all do it for this first one click hold and then move your mouse piece then we shall come below we select all up to the last click hold and then move then after we release after releasing we right click then we go to size and we say widest so that they can match this size so we click widest and here we have all our fields in case there is some fields moving off it is just upon us to reduce to that size we want so this is some of the things we can do with our form so with this form design option you open your form in the design view as we can see from the status bar and you can see we are dealing with only the fields but not the data or the records in the form so to view the records in the form we go to the 
view option then click on form view then here you can see the records even for the rest of the others we can now use this option if you go back to view and click on layout you can click on it so from this layout we can do a lot of formatting as we can see just as we have been doing in other forms if we want to save our form we can right click and click on save so when you click on save you go ahead and give your form a name so to give your form a name you will click inside there and delete that information so we shall call it workers design form then we click ok and you have your form created we can now close the form either using this button or just right click and say close all so when you click on close all you will close that form i just encourage you to keep on trying working with this object otherwise that's it for now see you in our next tutorial